This video will walk you through uploading your work to the SUNY Digital Repository. To be able to upload your files, you must first create an account. For instructions on creating an account, please watch the previous video in this series, Creating an Account. Go to the SUNY Digital Repository homepage, located at dspace.sunyconnect.suny.edu, and click on the link at the top that says Log In. Fill in your maritime email address and repository password and hit Sign In. You will now need to navigate to our Faculty Publications Collection. Find SUNY Maritime College on the list of Communities. Then click on the link that says Stephen B. Luce Library. And lastly, the link for the Faculty Publications Collection. Now you can click the button that says Submit a new item to this collection. The first form is for the basic information about the document you are uploading. There are a lot of fields, many of them optional, but they are to help make it easier for researchers to locate your work. Fill in the author information. Additional authors may be added using the Add button at the end of the line. Main title. Any alternate titles. The date of issue. Publisher of the finished work. Standard citation. Series or report number, if applicable. Any associated identifiers like the URI or ISSN. The type of document, article, book, chapter, report, etc. And the language. Then hit Next. There's more information to fill out on this next form. You can add keywords and subject terms, an abstract, sponsor information, and any other descriptions or comments. Once you've filled out this form, hit Next. Now it is time to upload your files. Hit the Browse button to navigate to the location of your file and hit Open. If you like, you may add a brief description of the file, which is helpful if you have multiple files to upload. If you have additional files, you can hit the Upload File and Add Another button. Otherwise, you can hit Next. This is the Review screen. From here, you can look over the information you provided on the previous forms. To make corrections, hit the Correct One of These button under the section you wish to edit. Once you are satisfied with your data, hit Next. Now you can select the type of Creative Commons license applicable to your work. More information on the types of Creative Commons licenses can be found in our Faculty Scholarship Guide. In most cases, we recommend selecting the Creative Commons option, but publisher agreements may require you to select the No Creative Commons License option. Select an option and hit Next again. This is the distribution license. Please read the agreement, which gives SUNY the right to distribute, backup, and preserve your work through this platform. If you agree, check the box and hit Complete Submission. Once you have submitted your document, it will enter the review process. The collection administrator will look over the entry, and once it is approved, you will then receive an email saying your submission has joined the collection.